What is good, everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today, we are back with a brand new WWE action figure toy hunt. Going to be hitting up a few stores here. I'm actually at Target right now. We're going to go in there. I don't think I've been on a toy hunt since... I think the, the first toy hunt we went on was when we got back from San Diego Comic-Con. And then we came to Target and we found the Legends figures. We found Adam Cole. I found that 60th anniversary, Then Now Forever Together set. And what else? I, I feel like that, I spent like 200 bucks. It was insane. I didn't even film it. I should have made a toy hunt that time, but... I was really exhausted from San Diego Comic-Con and I was kind of sick. You know, I started feeling that sickly feeling and I was just was out of it completely. But that, that definitely made the trip better. But I wanted to do a toy hunt today and it's a very exciting day. So right now we are at Target First Location. We're going to go there and find out what they got. I don't think I've ever worn, to, I, I don't think I've worn sunglasses on the channel in forever. So I feel like a, a Jack A right now. But bright as hell outside and it's hot as hell outside. So I'm, I'm rocking them right now and... Uh, Anyways, let's shut the hell up. I'll see you guys on the aisle, and uh, let's get into the first location. All right, fellas, first location, Super Target, right there. Let's go inside, see what they got. Hopefully, I don't even know what I'm on the hunt, on the hunt for. I'm just I'm just going, man. I'm just going. We're gonna see what we got. All right, guys, here we are, Target. Oh my God, in heaven, Brad. Look at that right there. John Silver. What a steal! Absolute steal, John Silver. So we got John Silver in the house. Oh, and his buddy Jungle Uno. Two rare figures right here, buddy. Never seen these in person before. We have the Rock Top Talents. We have the Apple Target exclusive. Already bought one of these. Don't know if I want a loose one, really. I'm just going to keep it mid in the box, I guess. Maybe, you know, clearance or something like that, maybe. But, Ron Rousey, Omos. We got Ron Rousey again. Roman Reigns Top Talents. Anna J. Hope Trifecta for Legends figures. Don't see a chase, but this looks like they have the full Legends wave, I do believe. You got Blood of Love, you got Karma. You got the Undertaker back here. This Undertaker figure, man. Great Undertaker figure. Love the way this figure looks, man. Full review on the channel. Doing pretty damn good. We have the forklift down there, of course. We have, I mean, Zeus is a crazy pull. We have Zeus in the house. No other figures from the set, but we do have Zeus. Mr. Perfect Builder figure. Really wish that had a Ziggler. If they had a Ziggler, you know I'm buying that. Another Ronda Rousey. I mean, it's not like a complete, just an utter waste of time, but I don't think I need any of this. We also have the Monster Truck here. I haven't seen that in person. We have the Monster Truck here. We got the forklift as well, of course, pairing that together. But nothing else, man. I mean, what, what else do you need here? Nothing else. I don't see Jack Squat. So we're moving on to the next one. You know, this monster truck is pretty massive. It's pretty damn big. Look at my hand. It's, it's, it's definitely not small, but this is the first time I'm getting to see this in person. I like the artwork on the monster truck. I'm going to come back and show you guys this. Rey Mysterio launching out in the air. And then the graphics on the back and everything are pretty cool. It'd be pretty fun to like shoot one of these. Got the edits in there. It's pretty cool artwork and stuff. Like that. Probably a fun that with nostalgia, but that is the forklift, and we're going to put this back right here. Yes. Right. All right, Brad, store number two, we're at Walmart. When the hell did they get this new, I mean, it's not a new logo, but I don't remember them changing the outside of the store. It probably has been like that for like four years, and I've just now really noticed it. Or maybe I did notice it. No, it's just kind of weird. Maybe they repainted it or something. Something's weird out here, fellas. Nonetheless, I'll see you guys on the aisle. Hopefully, they don't have garbage. All right, fellas, here we are. Look at this shish right here, man. Ruthless Aggression Elites in the house. We have The Rock right there. They have the full set, it looks like. We got the full set. You have The Rock here, Hollywood Rock, looking very good. We also have MVP here, black and white. Got the Under Armour gloves in there, looking pretty sweet. Nice figure right here. Even though I didn't really agree with the attire choice, I still like the figure a lot. And then we have The Miz here, which is probably the bummer in the set, at least to me personally. But what a great figure, man. Not really great figure. Great set is what I meant. But you have a couple more rocks here. We got another MVP. They're pretty loaded up with Ruthless Aggression Elites. Plenty of Ruthless Aggression Elites to go around. Too bad this set is discontinuing, of course, but I don't see any Ultimate Editions. But it is nice to see these in person. Of course, the old AEW just just, just rotting here for the love of God. So many faith. Lance Archer here for eternity, man. Here for eternity. Anna J. Holy smokies. We got Macho Man and the Rock Superstars. I think this is Series 5. Earthquake and Rick Rude. Who else we got over here? Shawn Michaels. Haven't ever seen that one. But what? That's, that's got a Scott Hall box on it or something like that. What the hell is this right here? It's got like a clearance sticker on it. What? What is? Is this not missing the IT title? But it's it's in the Scott Hall box. It's got the Scott Hall box, but it's a Shawn Michaels. I guess it's a repack, but they just didn't put the title in there. Damn. 
Never seen that in person, though. So, it's my first time seeing it, and it's repacked. Of course it is, Brad. But we have the Rock, Macho Man. I don't know if I'll ever see these again, man. This Rock figure it just has stood out, man. That cow vest is fantastic. These are, oh my lord, Ultimate Warrior, Ultimate Edition. This is the reissue. You guys can see the new torso. Got the reissued Warrior. We got reissued Greatest Hits, Ultimate Edition, Stone Cold. I mean, Greatest Hits, you know what I mean. The best of Ultimate Edition, Stone Cold, and Ultimate Warrior here. Never seen these in person, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I don't see any other Ultimates, though. We don't have any Ruthless Aggression, but we do have the Stone Cold Steve Austin Monster Truck in the house. Got a lot of those, geez. Got two of these up there that are also on the top here. Tons of them up top. Look at this right here. Never getting rid of those, man. I guess we'll see. I just don't know how well they're going to do. But Jimmy Uso. Got Jimmy Uso, Jimmy Uso, Jimmy Uso, Jimmy Uso, Jimmy Uso, Jimmy Uso, and Jimmy Uso. So plenty of Usos here, you know. I mean, I guess you could buy them, mod the hair, and have both Usos. I know the tattoos are different. Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns, and more Roman Reigns. So tons of Roman Reigns down here. But all this looks, I mean, dude, this Walmart stacked. Absolute stacked Walmart right now. Got a lot of Romans, got a lot of Jimmys, and we saw the Rock at the Target, so we have seen the complete top pick set, but I don't see any Rock figures here. The only Rock figures I see, Brad, are the Hollywood Rock and the Superstars version, so that's pretty cool right there, but we do have Earthquake here. I've never seen this set before. I don't ever find new Superstars, so this is this is a crazy day right here, man. Got Earthquake, we have Rick Rude. I don't know if I want to pull the trigger on these, man. I just feel like, Jesus. They just, they, I just wish they didn't cost so much. But, I mean, they are amazing figures. I love the cloth goods, but I don't know if I can do it today, especially since I'm getting the Ruthless Aggression Elites. Uh, I really wish they had the Brock Lesnar and RVD. God, if they had those, or even the Eddie Guerrero and Rey Mysterio. I haven't seen those either. Got some basics over here. The Rey Mysterio, Kushida. Interesting. Big E, top picks, just the standard. Tamina. Ooh, Tamina. That's the new Tamina. Don't like Tamina, but great to configure right there. I don't see the chase, or unless that's the chase, and there's just two of them. Matt Riddle, best of John Cena, Big E. We got Bobby Lash, Matt Riddle. I just don't think there's anything worth grabbing right here, man. I just don't see it. What's the point? We got, oh, snap. We got the Lego Spider-Man No Way Home set. Look at this right here. Never seen this in person. Seen plenty of, you know, different things about it, but haven't seen it in person right there. My son would flip his freaking lid if he saw this. I'll probably buy this eventually. I'm not going to buy it today, but I'll definitely grab this eventually. We'll definitely be putting this up. Me and him will build it together. Oh, look. Got the John Cena top picks out of the box. I hate to see it. And then we have nothing else. G.I. Joe's, a couple of Masters figures, nothing too crazy or anything like that. Nothing I need right here, but... Pretty stacked Walmart. I'm going to grab what I need, and then uh, I'll see you guys at the house for what we grabbed on this toy hunt. All right, guys, we're back home. After the toy hunt, we're going to reveal what we got right here. Should be good stuff, man. I'm pretty excited. Starting out first, we do have the Ruthless Aggression Elites, and I did grab all three. I went ahead and grabbed MVP, The Rock, and The Miz. Here is the MVP figure. Looking pretty clean in the, in the black and white right there. Still pretty pumped about them. We do have that figure. We also have ourselves the Miz figure, which also looks pretty clean here. Definitely going to do a full in-depth review of all three of these guys in one video. I think that's the way to go. So we get the Miz and MVP, and then rounding out our set, we did get the Hollywood Rock figure, which low-key might be my favorite figure in the set, or it's definitely, it's definitely up there. I think we've been waiting on this one for quite a long time, so I'm very excited to have this guy in the collection. Uh, I think the formula is good and all those different things. The belt buckle looks really fire. Reminds me of Here Comes the Pain, so... Really excited for all the three of these figures. And then something crazy happened. I did end up grabbing a Superstars figure. And the one that I grabbed is The Rock. Now, this is this is where the story gets interesting. Is I grabbed The Rock and I made it all the way up to the register with all four of these guys. I just figured that I probably won't see these guys again, right? I just didn't feel like I would see these guys again. So I had my Rock figure, my Superstars, and I had these guys. And I was sitting there and I was like... Oh my God, Brad, the Macho Man was there. And we don't know about his deal, right? His deal, all his future figures right now are on hold, at least for the, you know, for the foreseeable future right now. We don't know what the case is. So I was like, dude, I need to go back and I need to grab that Macho Man. So that is exactly what I did. And I'm pretty excited, pretty happy that I did, man. The Macho Man, we got the rock. I did not get the other two. Didn't get Rick Rude, didn't get Earthquake. I'm so behind on these figures, it's so sickening, but I never, like, this is Series 5, and I've only seen, I think I've seen Series 3 before, 
I don't think I've ever seen Series 4. I can't I can't even remember. I know I have Series 1. I have those men on card and loose, but these these two are going to be open because they're they're punched, so I'm just going to go ahead and open them. No point in leaving them, you know, in the box or whatever. But this is our full haul right here. I also picked up a few things for football, like pregame, that I want to do with my guys. So we're going to do that for our pregame tonight. We actually have a game tonight, so wish us luck here. But it's just a jamboree, not an official game, but it is. It's still getting us better, you know what I mean? And uh, I'm excited for it. But we do have Macho Man Randy Savage. We have The Rock, and then we have The Ruthless Aggression Elise. But that is going to wrap up the video, man. Thank you guys so very much for watching. I am editing this on my phone, so I will not have I will not have my patron little wall thing there. But a huge shout-out to our patrons, man. Love you guys so much. Thank you guys for your continued support here on the channel. But that is going to wrap up today's toy hunt video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Leave me your thoughts on everything down in the comment section below. I thought it was a pretty damn loaded toy hunt. I mean, that Walmart was completely loaded. Loaded, completely loaded Walmart and apparently the Ruthless Aggression Ultimates were there at one point but somebody hit me up and said yo these are those these are actually I, I grabbed them there was only one of each and I grabbed them but that, that's okay I think I will find them but it was the RVD and the Brock Lesnar but anyways man hopefully we'll find those soon I can get a review up for you guys but I'm getting out of here thank you for watching subscribe to the channel follow me on Instagram Twitter and TikTok at my damn toys I'll see you guys later have a blessed one and I'll catch you later